Welcome to Lion Direct. Teachers, this is a quick reminder about flu shots. They will be available October 16th, but you have to sign up in the mail room and fill out the proper forms. Sophomore students interested in applying for the Hobie Leadership Scholarship need to stop by the front office and pick up an application. These forms are due to Ms. McLary no later than Wednesday, November 1st. And now Clint Moore with a volleyball update. Hi, I'm Clint Moore here with the Line Direct. We're here with Coach Faden, the Greenwell uh, Lady Lions volleyball coach. We're here to ask her a few questions. As the team approaches the last four games of district play, where does the team stand? What are the greatest accomplishments? Right now we're sitting in fourth place with a very good shot of getting into third place. The top three teams will make playoffs. Um, we're going to play Mesquite Petite tonight. They're in third place, and we're hoping to knock them off tonight and force them into a, a two-way tie for third, at least. Uh, we're sitting pretty good. The girls have really come on strong the last few matches. I think we've gotten better as the district has progressed. Successful 2005 season. What type of training has the team done to become a better 2006 season to the same results? Well, uh, last year was very successful for the girls. We have a few more, uh, or a few different girls that are on the team this year than last year. Of course, we graduated some seniors. Uh, we pulled up some girls that are juniors this year on a varsity and a sophomore. I think uh, one of the things, if it's not broke, you don't know, fix it. And we did very well last year, so we're training pretty much the same way that we trained last year. Uh, the girls come in every day and I push them and they respond very well and they push themselves too. They want to be better each and every match and that is uh, really being shown each and every match that we go through in district. As I said, we're getting better all the time. They work really hard during practice. How has the district change affected the team from the previous district championship team? Well, I think uh, we are definitely in a tougher district this year. We were realigned with uh, J.J. Pierce, and who dropped from a 5A school and made playoffs last year. Highland Park is now in our district that made playoffs last year, and so did Mesquite Petite. Uh, it's a definitely tougher district, but I think the girls have definitely risen to the challenge, and I think we're actually playing better than we did even last year because they have to play at a higher level. Highland Park and J.J. Pierce are both ranked within the top 15 state of the state uh, right now. And uh, excuse me, Highland Park, we played our first game against them, 32-34. That's one of the highest scoring uh, games on record here at Greenville High School. Ready when you are. All this is a team sport. Do you have any members that establish a leadership spot and who are they? Yes, uh, like you said, this is a team sport and there is no way that one individual can win a game or even lose a game as I tell the girls because it takes uh, everybody to win the game. Uh, Jackie Jones is actually our leader for kills and digs at this time and blocks but and has stepped up in a leadership role. However, I do have other seniors who are also my captains, Brooklyn Parker and uh, Gabby Castillo that actually have stepped up and performed uh, leadership in different areas and in different types of roles. Thank you for your time and good luck for the season. Back to you at the studio. Thanks, this has been a Lion Direct Brief.